I'm going to share a song. I'm driving down the road, and God's telling me something. I'm thinking about silver and gold, and Peter says to the blind man, as he's begging, please, anything, please. He says, silver and gold I have not, but what I do have, I'll give you, and gave him his sight. How much more is that worth than silver and gold? And I thought, I'm going to write a song about that. So here's the song I wrote about that whole story, about what I've been given that I will also give to you. I don't have cash, but I've got knowledge. I went to school. I have no college, I don't have silver, and I don't have gold, and though I won't all in a bad hand, yeah, I'd rather fold, I've been high upon the mountain, but I refuse to go low, I wear my heart on my sleeve, but I refuse to let it show, yeah, my heart times just I've fallen, but I'll always rise again, I discard all my enemies close by my side, I keep my friends. There's one thing that I know I will always keep true That what I've been given I will also give to you For I got life And I got love And I got angels all around me From a good God above And I got a heart That won't let go This is the one thing That I wanted you to know What I've been given, I will also give to you. For I got life, and I got love. Well, I got angels all around me from a good God above. And I got a heart that won't let go. This is the one thing that I wanted you to know. I wanted you to know. things and I'm like, God, hey, you, you gave me life, which is Christ. You gave me love, which is you. Got angels all around me. How can I complain? Even when bad things are happening. <clears throat> God is good. He will do it. He's already done it. You just got to believe. Uh, your job, it's there. Yeah. All you have to do is believe it. And God's going to test you. Yeah. He's going to test you. I just had an accident Wednesday. Total my truck, basically. Yeah. Driving down the road and going past the lake and and there's a train track, and I'm thinking, oh, there's a train track going to the lake. So, duh, I love. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone else saw the red light and stopped. Not me. I look for it, boom, I didn't even hit the brakes. Oh, my God, my whole front end goes up. I hit her so hard, she rolls in, boom, hits another truck. I'm like, oh, my God. Transmission fluid's coming at the bottom of my thing. And I'm thinking, oh, my God, God, no, this didn't happen. I can't. I want to rewind it, rewind it. Re I can't. I get out of my truck, I'm freaking out, I'm like, oh my, and I'm asking the lady, are you okay? And she's a Mexican lady, she's like, ah, <laughs> <laughs> ah are you okay? <laughs> she's like, ah. I said, ma'am, I need to know, are you okay? She goes, I'm okay. <laughs> and you can see she's doing this, trying to dial a phone, and I'm like, oh my God, and my heart's going, kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. So I, I, the two other ladies get out, and I think, oh, they're going to sue me, because they had that look on their face, like, my neck. I'm thinking, oh my God, come on, I hit her, she ain't complaining. But I'm praying, God, mercy, grace, mercy, grace, mercy, grace, please. 
few minutes into it, I call my insurance company, tow truck beats the fire department there, everybody shows up, no police report, and we're all Christians, and we're all out there preaching the gospel through doing Oh, no. <laughs> 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 now my truck's so bad, I'm going to pay to the nose for the next few years. But God's going to do it. That prayer thing, you can't prove it. I met a kid one time, I'll tell you another story that's funny. A friend of, a, a friend of mine brings his kid, you got to talk to him about God. I'm like, ay, 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 I'm in a hurry. <laughs> but I'll do it. So, <laughs> three hours later, he goes, why don't you just shut the F up? I'm like, oh, come on. <laughs> hours I stood here. He goes, you'll never convince me there's a God. I reached out, I said, thank you. That's not my job, but before I leave, I'm going to show you the color. Check it out. He goes, you can't prove gravity. I said, how the hell am I going to prove God? <laughs> I said, but gravity works every time. Climb up the ladder two stories, I'll shake it. You'll say, don't do that. Why? Because when you fall, it hurts, but you don't have to prove it. You have faith. I walk away. Three, uh, three days later, my friend called, you're going to call Kevin. He accepted Christ. I said, I ain't, call, I ain't talking to that dude. I'm done. He goes, no, he accepted Christ. I said, dude, you're pulling my leg. I said, no way. Hey, see, there's his number. He lives in San Antonio. So I call him up on the phone. Hey, I'm looking for Kevin. Mark, I accepted Jesus. I went, oh, come on, dude, seriously. He said, dude, I got thrown out of the back of my own truck right after I left you. He had, he had slept in his own truck. He was so tired. It was a small truck that his girlfriend was driving. She fell asleep at the wheel, and she hit a Greyhound bus, and boom, he shot out the back on 35, doing 55 miles an hour. Shattered all the bones in his shoulder, road rash all over his body, but never hit his head. <laughs> And I said, the gravity thing. Oh, it's freaking great. Hey, you know, it works every time. He said, he said, no, no, it wasn't that. He said, something you said. I said, what did I say to you? I thought the gravity thing was the last thing I said to you. He goes, no, he said, you, he said, you said, I'd rather live my whole life and believe that there's a God and die and find out there's not than live my whole life believing there's not a God and yes. die and find out there is. I said, when did I say that to you? He goes, I don't know. It's the only thing I remembered in the three-hour conversation. <laughs> <laughs> then he came here from San Antonio and his mom hugged my neck crying oh thank you I said don't you thank me you thank him you think I'd have said a word to him I wouldn't have wasted my time if I didn't believe in God myself now I can't prove God to you it's impossible but this is different in here and you're never going to prove God because he said we must live by faith if God really wanted to show us he could make this thing float or whatever but that's not faith you must live by faith and you know what the older I get the faster it goes and I can't wait to be with him and go see this whole universe. And I told God already, the first thing I want to go is Jupiter, that storm. I just want to check that out. That's just cool. And there's more stuff we can't even see. I'll sing one more song if you don't mind. Yeah, sure.